what do you guys think of these? Welcome back to my channel if you're new welcome if you're returning thank you so much for coming back this is actually the first time i pick up the camera in 2024 in this apartment i think i think this is the first time but today is the 28th of january i'm even so embarrassed to say it so 28th of january i just finished filming so i was filming a foundation um campaign and I must say, I love it. I'm not too sure if it's dark or... The thing is, with this thing, I'll make it light on the screen. And then when I edit, it becomes too bright. But anyways, yeah, I just thought I'd start the vlog off here. Um, and yeah, I just have like a few unboxings I want to do with you guys. And then I'm heading off to my sister's because we are uh, watching church together. So I'm just going to go there. I've just packed like my gym stuff. I might just end up sleeping there because church starts at 8. And I don't think I want to be driving back. So I've just packed like my, um, like a small overnight bag with just my gym stuff. Stuff I need for the gym in the morning. So I'll go in the to the gym in the morning. We usually wake up at 5. And then I will uh, come back home instead of going back to hers. So I just thought I'd show you guys a couple of items that I purchased. I did purchase like some stuff from Zara on the sale and I just thought I'd show you guys. So I'll start with this which I actually got in store and it's a pair of heels. They are so cute. Um, but yeah, I thought these would be great for like work and stuff. So I got these cute little black heels with like gold um heels on them and then it's like um it's like this twilly um material and they were originally 1200 but i got them for 499 so yeah sorry about that i got them for 499 they're super cute not too high and yeah i just think they're a nice pair to like have so i got that which i got in store then i did a number i bought like i was like trying to blur this part out i got like a zara i bought stuff online because i knew if i go in store i didn't think i would be able to find like sizes so i just got like online i'll put like the pictures here but I got these shorts. They look so cute. I've actually already tried them out. It's like these leather shorts. Um, they're nice, not too tight. I decided to take a size large because I didn't want them too tight on me. Um, and this is what they look like. They're like high-waisted and I feel like they'll look really, really nice. Something else that I got that looks super cute. When I opened it, I didn't think it looked cute till I actually wore it. Is these Bermuda shorts they pink I know like who would have thought that I would get something pink but they look really nice as well and I'm thinking of creating like a Valentine's Day look with these I just need to get like a shirt and then I'm gonna create the look you guys will see it on Instagram but they look nice as well they also high-waisted and I also got them in a large because I didn't want the shorts tight I really wanted them like super loose the next thing I got is just these, um, what do you call these? It's not really linen, but it's just like these pants. They also look really nice. I also got them in a size large because I wanted like that loose baggy fit. I love the fact that they've got the drawstring, so I'm able to like tighten it on my waist, but then it still looks like nice and loose which is super great and then there's two items which i got which i'm going to be returning because these are gonna large and they are way too big um i don't think they'll still have a medium by now but it's just like these um denim jeans i mean they looked really nice i'm super sad to be taking them back but they are way too big like they don't fit at all so I'm taking that back and then the next thing I also got which I'm taking back 
is these leather trousers. So these leather trousers are, they don't look nice on me. They leave like this weird bulge in the front. And also when I receive them, I don't know why they've got like some sort of dye on them. I don't know if you guys can see on the camera, but I'm returning those. And then last thing, which I actually didn't try that I should have, I got this denim boob tube dress which everybody has in like the blue but i decided to go for the black because i just thought black is more timeless than the normal denim blue so this is what it looks like looking forward to styling it hopefully it fits because i got it in a medium and then one other thing i also got that we are all going crazy about i went to africa rise because more of africa is like too far and i don't like that more but I would have loved to go purchase these directly from Beauty on Tap. But I think everyone is finishing them. So I like restocked on the pastry. She did send us a press drop of like the um, body wash. And when I tell you if you have eczema. I don't know if, if this has been helping me. But it really has been helping with my eczema. So I decided to get the fragrance free this time. So I got two of them just to like make sure that they don't run out. And then because of the, was it a TikTok or a video that a girl posted where she said the two put together are great. Already with the wash, I feel like it's been getting rid of like my dark neck and stuff like that. But apparently if you pair them together with the lotion, it's really great. And this has got niacinamide. I also got the fragrance free one. The wash I think has salicylic acid. So it's salicylic acid and niacinamide. Apparently it's a good combination. So I got these on friday yeah i think i bought these on friday and then something that's super cute my sister got me a birthday gift so we when we went to the mall she decided to spoil me and this is my first designer item i actually don't own anything that is designer so we like walked into coach and she um always laughs at like my wallet um and stuff so she decided to spoil me buy me something cute so it comes in this little packaging over here I don't know if you guys can see coach and then um it obviously comes in this coach bag and then this is the wallet i really really like it i liked the color um and also i like the fact that let me open it it's actually got enough space to like put money so i would like to her wallets don't come empty you know they need to come with some more like, we were hoping for like the blue or the orange but you know we'll settle with what is this pink or purple we'll, we'll settle with this you know it will call its friends and it will call higher friends it's bigger friends so yeah she wanted to give it to me with like no money and i was like girl bye so yeah, um, it's really, really cute. So it's got the space for the money there. It's got space for coins here. If you want, hardly ha have coins. I also feel like coins just damage like a wallet. They change the shape. So I feel like, yes, I'll put cash in there and then I'll just put like my cards here. So yeah, it's super, super cute. I really, really like it. Um, I just have way too many cards, like all these cards from these stores that we get so i'm gonna have to be very selective of what cards i put in here i'm gonna most probably gonna have like my important bits like my medical aid card and all of that stuff but yeah thank you to my sister i have a new designer item this is my first designer item I'm super happy about it um i'll use it maybe this week so i'm gonna put it back in the duffel bag um and then use it sometime this week so yeah i'm just gonna pack my bag i'm gonna take you guys with me i'm most probably gonna remove these because i don't need them anymore and they're just gonna make my ears sore so i've packed like my charges and stuff and then i'm just gonna try edit this vlog um because i'm trying to be very like consistent with the stuff that i do also if you guys follow me on instagram please go support like look at how cute my 
I'm trying to with I go in with this Mary Badescu spray just to make sure that my face is not completely dry and then I will just let that dry down a bit. I will then go in with this vitamin C serum just as an oil base to easily flat my blade. I use these blades that I get from Mr. Price. They are quite affordable. So the first step is to make sure that your face is fully lathered in oil which makes it easier for the blade to dry down. So once that's done you want to grab your blade and you want to hold onto your skin just to make sure that you have some sort of grip. Um, you want to make sure that you glide the blade in downward motions. Um, make sure that it's not too harsh on your skin because you can easily cut yourself. As you guys can see, I do this once a month and I do have quite a bit of hair on the lower part of my face as compared to the top part of my face. Don't know why, but that's the case. And this is all the hair that came out and I really love the results. And yeah, hope you enjoy it. So yeah, as I was saying, um, I want to start posting more organic content and like sharing like my tips and tricks and things that I love with uh, things that are actually not sponsored so that you guys can also like, you know, have some great tips and tricks. But yeah, I'm going to pack up now and go so that I'm not late. Just need to get my watch so I don't forget it. Um, I think I need to carry some tampons because my period is supposed to start. I don't know when but also can we talk about this foundation it's so lightweight i really really like it but yeah um i think i did mention in my last vlog i'm wishing you guys a happy 2024 i hope you all win i hope you all um work on your goals and your dreams and i really just hope that god blesses us all this year i have a feeling that this is our year i know people always say oh i have a feeling this is our year but definitely 2024 is our year um, and yeah, I just hope you all have a blessed 2024. So yeah, I'm going to go to my sister. Otherwise, I'm going to ramble too much. And I'm sure she's waiting for me. Um, church starts at 8. It's currently 10 to 7. So I still have time. And if I leave now, I can have a bit of time to like edit till I get to her, um, till church starts. So yeah, I'm just going to do that. And then yeah, I'll, I'll take the camera with me, vlog quite a little bit. But I'm not going to take it to the gym tomorrow. I'll see. Maybe it's quite big to like take it to the gym. And it's like too obvious. And like I don't want to draw that much attention in the gym. So maybe I'll try to take some footage on my phone or something. We'll see. We'll see. But let's Guys, I was wrong about the time.
starts as my snipers hit their marks And your guards fall down from a rifle to the heart Like clap, clap, let them fall slow I know you had your fears, you can let them all go And most women are motivated, so I act accordingly But this is so refreshing that it means a little more to me Dedicated time when I really can't afford to be I'll provide protection if you open up the door for me Couple stares, couple texts, couple dates Couple I think that we're ready Couple I think we should wait Are we acting like a couple? I'm just trying to get it straight Cause I'm over here convinced that it's too early for mistakes And then Ooh, you have to change up the game Oh, the weather is not the same Every night was passionate Plus you met my mother even if it was an accident I'm confused, tell me where we go wrong I was sure that I would be with you for so long I was planning on this being something worth mentioning Energy invested in someone I saw potential in Who killed Shivery? They need to get their sentence in Meanwhile we arguing and I can't get a sentence in just as I predicted, here we go again. They always say the hottest love has the coldest end. Oh, you had to change up the game. Oh, the weather is not the same. Now there's only cloudy days. You can't stand the rain in July. There were fireworks exploding.
hey guys so i'm actually landed i just didn't vlog much um till i arrived but i arrived safely i'm in abidjan so yeah i'm super super excited i'm here for the afcon so i'm going to be watching a couple of games so i'm looking forward to that i'm obviously not going to take you guys around with the camera but i'll definitely take you guys with on my phone um but yeah just thought i'd come vlog in here the room is a bit we're not gonna say anything but yeah it's a bit yeah i feel like i'm not gonna vlog much in here um it's just got like this damp smell that doesn't make sense it's like damp moldy I don't want to complain too much. Let me go. It's not that I don't want you here. It's something about the way you stay. Currently 6 a.m. here. I've been up since like 5. Um, and that's because it is two hours difference in Joburg. So I'm just gonna quickly change and do a grow with Job workout in here because I wanna work out. I don't wanna miss my workouts. So, and I'm doing a 28, well, 29 day walking challenge. So I need to walk every single day and do like a minimum of a certain steps. So, um, I'm just gonna work out. Yeah. I didn't sleep quite good. Like my chest hurts. It's like this damp smell that's annoying my chest but like it's not a damp smell but it smells like it's damp that's how i can explain it but anyways good morning um i hope you guys are doing well let's quickly change <laughs> face um, I'm ready now I'm just gonna go down for breakfast and then I think we're going to watch the um, we are going to watch the Bafana Bafana versus Cape Verde match hopefully that goes well the Nigeria versus Angola yesterday was fun um, but yeah so just thought I'd come on here show you guys what I look like I'm in all black my favorite colors and sneakers um, I basically love my job because I get to be comfortable and I'm not it's not like I always have to be in heels like being in sneakers is like my favorite comfort and I just love it let me show you guys what I look like quickly before I head down um, if it can actually focus so yeah this is what I'm wearing I'm wearing these are pants 
I'm wearing my Adidas Stan Smiths, just a plain black um, top from Mr. Price. I hate how my bras sit like this. I feel like my boobs have grown. So, yeah, just thought I'd come show you guys what I look like. Now let's head down and quickly eat and decide what's happening today. you guys what a mess i'm just literally getting into this room now because we couldn't drive back because it was too late um so we had to try find a hotel we've been looking for hotels since midnight it's i'm entitled to some fun while i'm young and dumb swear to joe the one i want in a long run baby let it slide obviously enjoyed the game yesterday I should don't know if you guys can hear me but I have like a long way home I am going through Qatar so it's 11 hour 20 minutes to Qatar then yeah 11 hour 20 minutes to Qatar then another 8 hours 35 minutes I think or something to Joburg so in total I am traveling for like 23 hours something, so I'll only be home tomorrow at around about like 3 or 3.30, I don't know, it's a very long journey, but I'm basically here, excuse me, because my stomach is upset, um, trust my stomach to be upset when I travel, so I'm basically, I'm at the lounge but I don't even eat, all I'm having is this and water, 
and then I'll try to eat something on the plane if I can because I just don't want to upset my stomach any further but I just thought I'd come on here and like let you guys know what's going on I'm leaving but yeah it was a very nice experience I enjoyed it I enjoyed watching the games um, I didn't really get to see much of the country but we did go to the basilica uh, yesterday um, but we didn't go inside because it was already closed so next time if I do come they've given me a year visa <laughs> I don't know if I'm gonna use it but if I ever do come to um, West Africa again then maybe this could be a possibility but yeah just thought I'd come on here and say hi um, I'm super excited I always love flying Qatar Airways especially like with their business class because it's amazing it's like you literally have a little room in the plane so that's the only thing I'm looking forward to because at least after I eat I can just close the door and like sleep. I'm hoping I do get some sleep on the way to Doha and maybe some sleep on the way to Joburg. So yeah, funny enough when I was at Oha Tambo I was very shy to vlog but now that I'm here I'm vlogging which is a weird like my vlogging phobia goes up and down. And then there's sometimes where I'm like really shy and sometimes where I'm like, okay, these people never see me again. But anyways, just thought I'd come on here. I'll update you guys. I'm gonna stop talking now because I'm gonna look like someone crazy that is talking to themselves.
I don't wanna play no games I just wanna call, see if we're okay, babe All I wanna ask you is I don't wanna push you farther away, no I don't wanna play no games I just wanna call, see if we're okay, babe All I wanna ask you is
guys, I am super happy that I did because I feel like I need to do, spoil myself sometimes because I don't. But I'm just having breakfast quickly and then I have to your uh, yes. and French toast also? No. Thank you. So yeah, I'm having some coffee. My sister was actually screaming at me right now for having milk, but I'm not sure. So yeah, I think I've gone through, this is the 4th or 5th refresher towel. Trying to make amends, but it doesn't seem to help. No, can't do one more night of having to sleep on the sofa. I just wanna figure it out now before it's over. I don't wanna pack my things and be ready to let you go. To let you go, but maybe it's too late to figure it out. To make it through, maybe it can't wait. Maybe it's time. Wanna figure it out now before it's over I don't wanna pack my things and be ready to let you go To let you go But maybe it's too late to figure it out to make it through Maybe it can wait, maybe it's time, maybe we're doomed Try to pull you closer, cause I don't wanna go yet But maybe it's too late to figure it out to make it through Maybe it's too late Maybe it's too late. Maybe it's too late. Maybe it's too late. 